So I want to address something real quick. This person that's been commenting me has been pestering me on every video ever since I made the video about the Henny Sottles saying that, oh, this guy used to cry about tearing down statues and this and that and now he wants to teach about natives and say he's native. Well, let me set the record straight. Nobody said I'm native, bro. I'm Hispanic. I teach New Mexico history. I teach New Mexico history from a Hispanic perspective. Now, there's other Native American historians that will tell it from a Native American perspective. But I'm a Hispanic, so I tell it from a Hispanic perspective. And yes, I will teach Native American history. There's nothing wrong with that. Native American history has to do with New Mexico history. There wouldn't be New Mexico history without Native Americans. And the history also wouldn't be so good without the Spanish invasion. And we wouldn't be who we are today if the Spanish and the Native Americans wouldn't have mixed. We're mestizos. So let me read this. E, this guy was crying years ago about the statues being torn down. I'll pin the video to my account if you want to see it. Now he's doing native history when he was crying about the... And it, it dots off so I don't know what else it said. But they did pin that comment. They didn't pin a video. They pinned a comment where I said that... Well, okay, let me explain. This person was pestering me and pestering me and pestering me. When I'm going through my comments, I see the same person pestering on every video talking shit. And eventually I comment back. And they were telling me, oh, you Spaniards lost. You guys ain't shit. This ain't new Spain. You know, trying to talk shit about every video I did. So, and... Well, of course I talk shit back. And so when I bucked back, they want to go cry, saying that out. And I was saying, yeah, the natives were crying. Oh, tear down the statues. Change the name to this school. Change the name to that school. I did make a video about that back in the day. Hell yeah. And I do still feel the same way. I don't like that they're tearing down our statues. I don't like that they're changing the name to Vargas Middle School. They changed that name. Oñate Middle School and Las Cruces, they changed that name. I understand that my ancestors, the Spanish people, did some very fucked up things. They committed genocide. They enslaved the Native Americans. They used them. And never once did I say this was right. I've always just taught that it happened because it did happen. Now I teach it from a Hispanic point of view because I am Hispanic. I was born and raised in Santa Fe, New Mexico. They taught us about the conquistadores growing up. We celebrate fiesta every year. This shit's in our fucking DNA. I just want to set the record straight and tell people I'm not teaching Native American history. I'm teaching New Mexico history, which has to do with both the Spanish and the Native Americans. Anyway, I just wanted to set the record straight and say, yes, I'm a Hispanic. So I hate when they go rally and tear down our statues. I hate when they rally and try to tear down the shit that we love and that we put up to represent our history. But what I've always said too is that what I think they should do is leave our Spanish statues, but also make Native American statues. There's Indian country in between Santa Fe and Albuquerque. It's all reservations. They could put, there's a big hill when you're leaving Santa Fe going to Albuquerque. It looks like a perfect hill. If you guys know what I'm talking about, they should put a big old statue of Pope on that hill. They should put Native American statues too, because like I said, Native American history is in New Mexico history as well. Now, I don't know who this person is and why they think that all of a sudden I'm saying I'm Native because I'm teaching history that has to do with Native Americans. But no, bro, I'm Hispanic. But let me tell you a story. I was at the mall in Albuquerque a few weeks ago. I ran into somebody who was a Native American and he told me he watches my videos on TikTok. But he told me that the only advice he had to put in was that I should teach more about the natives of New Mexico. And so I told him I would. There's 19 pueblos left in New Mexico. Before that, there was maybe up to 75 I read. And so I'm going to do history about each and every one of these pueblos separately, all 19 of them. Then I'm going to do histories about the Apache of New Mexico, the Navajo of New Mexico, everybody. Because I teach New Mexico history. It don't matter if it's the Native American or Hispanic side. See, people like this in my comments who are trying to divide Hispanic and Native American, that's wrong. Because if you talk to a real Native American who knows his history and knows everything, we can have a good conversation together. Look in my comments and see how much Native Americans show me love. Because those are the educated Native Americans who know history. And if I'm ever wrong in anything I say, you tell me with respect and I'll reply to you with respect and we'll work it out. And I'll go look it up and if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But trust me, I do mad research before I do every video. I don't just come on here and do these videos. I do research. I make sure everything, I got the dates right, the names right. And if I don't find something, I let you guys know. Anyway, I just wanted to respond to this comment and kind of set the record straight on the Hispanic native thing. They're trying to, they're trying to, this person anyway, I don't want to say they, this person is trying to drag me through the mud and trying to like make me out to be a native hater just because I'm Hispanic. And, and I mentioned Native Americans in my history.
and and sometimes it's a good way in a good way sometimes it's in a bad way same thing with the spanish sometimes i mention them in a good way a lot of times because i'm talking about their conquest and stuff i'm hispanic i was raised taught that stuff just like the native americans were raised taught their history so they have pride for it same thing i'm i'm a hispanic so i have pride for my hispanic history there's nothing wrong with that but i don't disrespect the native american culture now, I might disrespect certain Native American people individually like this person when they're all bugging in my comments talking shit. Yeah, I'm going to eventually respond and reply and clap back. But come on, bro. It's just fucking internet shit. If you guys really have a problem with me like that, then when you see me, let me know. And if you don't like what the fuck I'm teaching, then just get the fuck off my channel. Go watch something else. Why are you commenting on every video? You're obviously watching every video. You want to be blowing me up commenting me on every video. You obviously care more than I do. Anyway, it's tragedy, I'm out.